Hey, what's up guys? I'm Tiger with Tiger Up Comedy Up back with another Dokkan battle video and today I want to make a follow-up video to my video from yesterday where I talked about how I thought that the animations for the new sticker system coming to JP looked really, really bad and I was scrolling through the comments for that video and some people were a little upset at me for the things that I said, right? So I want to start off by saying that I totally understand where you guys are coming from and uh, you know for the most part I was wrong in that video. Now to explain myself just a little bit, at the time I was filming that video there were only a few examples of what this new animation or this new system looked like and the primary example I had to go off of was uh, the free to play cards that Kawhi had posted. Alright so one example was this free-to-play Super Saiyan Blue uh, Goku's animation. Oh, let me just turn that off. And uh, you guys gotta admit, this looks really, really bad. Like by any standard, right? No matter if it's a free-to-play card or a summonable card or no matter what level of animation skills you have, like this is just really, really bad, right? And um, I was also disappointed by the fact that they kept the diamond background, which is also the case for all of the other summonable cards as well, but just the fact that like it looks like it's like a two frame per second animation. It looks like a looks like a GIF, you know. So um, I was going off of this. I was also going off of uh, this right here, the Int Goku Junior. So uh, yeah, obviously these ones do not look great, and the only summonable cards um, that I saw were for the Tech Hit and for the Int Goku Black, and those two were not overly impressive to me as well. Even though they did look better, I was like, they still don't look that good. So yeah, overall, I wasn't too jazzed about this new sticker system. But then after I posted the video, um, Hydros and a few other people came out with the animations for a bunch of other summonable cards that were getting special animations from stickers. And I was like, damn, these actually look really freaking good. So I take back what I said before, Bandai actually did do the system, you know, justice, right? They actually did a good job, or a lot of these summonable cards, like this Majin Vegeta you see here, um, they look amazing. Like, they really, really do. Like, look at this. Look at the effects on this Vegeta. He looks so freaking good. Like, the um, animations are super smooth, and I like where the actual effects are placed. Um, one thing about this one actually is that it's a little bit misleading because he actually removed the diamond background So it's not gonna look as good in game because there's still gonna be that diamond pattern But uh, you can still see even with the diamond pattern. I'm sure it's gonna look great, right? And some other examples are uh, This one right here the STR cooler. Actually, I think this one was a little bit lackluster um, Let's see yeah, so you got, you got the little, little lights coming up. Like, it still looks good, but it's nothing crazy. It's not too exciting. And uh, let's see what else we have here. Okay, so we have Int Future Gohan here. Let's see what he looks like. Okay, so similar effect. So for some of these guys, it's a little bit lacking still. Like, it's not... Um, it doesn't look like they put that much effort into it. But there are also some other ones that just look amazing. Like this Vegito Blue right here. I love that swirling effect going into the Kamehameha, like that looks phenomenal, the aura and everything looks great. And then I think one of my personal favorites right now that I've seen is, uh, how does this Gogeta look? I don't remember if I saw this one. So Super Saiyan Blue Gogeta. Oh, he looks okay. He looks okay. All right. And yeah, the, my personal favorite right now that I've seen is the, let's see, not definitely not this one. Definitely not this one. But, uh, oh, this one right here. So he's showcasing the Super Saiyan 4, Gogeta. And look at that, guys. Look at that animation. That looks super, super clean. I love that. That's probably my favorite so far. So all the ones that have like multiple things going on, you know, with like the effects for the actual super attack that they're performing in the card art, as well as like the, um, you know, other effects going around them, like the flame effects going on. I think those look really, really good. So I'm excited for those. Apparently one thing that uh, we learned, oh, cooler looks great too. The Fizz cooler actually looks better than the STR cooler in my opinion. Um, but uh, one thing we learned apparently is that, I think it was Kawhi that tweeted this, we can't remove the sticker effect 
once it's been applied so it's not like something you can like take you know take off and put on which is kind of weird because like in real life you know with a sticker you can take it off right and then put it back on but um i mean in real life it also gets like less sticky over time so it's not like you know ideal to peel off and put on but anyways my point is that i was wrong in that video all right the information i had at the time was not completely accurate and uh you know the sticker system actually is really well done i think bandai did a good job they look amazing for the most part some of them are a little bit boring but you know they all look pretty clean um at least for the summonable cards and one other thing that i realized from seeing this video is that the uh, one that Kawhi posted actually wasn't a accurate representation of what the free-to-play cards look like either because you'll see in a second um after he goes down to the bottom in this video that the free-to-play cards are actually pretty clean too okay look at this you see the difference between this versus the video that was posted on Kawhi's page so i don't really know what's going on there whatever the case may be um they do look a lot better in this video posted by hydros uh, a lot smoother definitely not two frames per second like they looked originally um i think one of my favorites actually is this um int GT Goku here. Uh, is he gonna click on it? Yeah, there we go. So yeah, that Universal Spirit Bomb there looks really, really good as well. So uh, yeah, I mean, I just wanna make this quick update video for those of you that were upset. I do admit that I was wrong. You know what, sometimes people make mistakes. Sometimes people go off of preliminary information and uh, get the wrong idea, which is exactly what happened in this situation. So I do apologize for that. And I also wanted to make this update video to uh, show you guys that, yeah, these cards actually look really good. Like for the most part, a lot of them do look really freaking good, especially the Super Saiyan 4 Gogeta. And even the free to play cards um, are pretty well done as well. So I'm looking forward to this sticker uh, feature once again. Can't wait to apply them to some of my favorite cards like the is uh, cooler and uh, this this Broly looks really amazing too. I, I just, I, I love it, I love it. No, it looks way better than I thought. So that's gonna do it for today's video. I was wrong, I admit it, it's okay. It happens to the best of us. And uh, next time, maybe I'll wait a little bit longer before I make one of those videos because I was like bought into the hype, right? I wanted to get my video out first and I was like, yo, these look really bad. I wanna get my opinion out there and uh, it was a mistake, so yeah. That's it guys, thank you so much for watching the video, thank you for understanding, and uh, as always, if you guys liked today's video, then make sure to like the damn video, and if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button to join the Tiger Squad now, and while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content, and that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, I hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.